What's going on guys, John Ellis here. Welcome back to another video. So today's video is about YouTube ads, something that a lot of people have been requesting. So I wanted to make a video. Now the thing is, I wanted to make a full tutorial, but uh, there's a lot of there's a lot of tutorials about them, so I don't want to bother. But what I wanted to do here is, I wanted to show you the progress, because I was going to do an ad today, like right about now, I was thinking about doing this, because we're t running this test ads, and I thought it'd be a good idea to just record it and show it to you guys and see how I do it and all that stuff so you can see it all in action really. And yeah, let's get it started. Let me show you exactly how you can start a YouTube ad campaign and uh, stuff that I usually do. Now there's a lot more because when I do, do a YouTube ad, I usually spend at least an hour and I don't wanna make this video an hour long, but just wanna show you the basics here and we'll talk more about other advanced stuff in the next videos maybe in future, all right? So let's get it started. All right, guys, so the example ad that I want to actually share with you and I want to do with you today is really cool and really special because this is a very different kind of advertising. Uh, so usually what we, when we do ads, we uh, do it to drive, to generate leads and sales, or leads or, you know, all that stuff. But in this case, this is a direct ad to a checkout page and we're actually uh, pre-qualifying this. Now, this is really, really important. There are two important aspects here. Number one, again, is the pre-qualification. Number two is the fact that it's a direct ad to a checkout page. So the video is this one. So I've already uploaded to my YouTube channel. This has been here for a while. Um, I did run some ads for a long time ago, but not in this format. But yeah, so if you take a look, um, we have the link to the checkout page here. And also we have the link to the checkout page here as well. So they can just, you know, go there. Again, uh, there's no pre-selling, nothing, because the video actually does it does it by itself. And also this video is so, um, the, it's a really great video at the same time, since the product we're selling is a $9 product, it's really, you don't have to really try that hard. You know, if someone's not gonna pay $9, why would you even want them as a customer? So that's the, that's the, point here okay and one more thing is that uh, if you want to do the same thing here if you want to do ads uh, and make commissions using this you can if you uh, you can do this as an adversity partner so if you already have an account if you bought a course with diversity or you have a partner account you can actually just go to your uh, flea section the partners link section and grab the link to the uh, checkout page of the three step system and run the ad like this, you know, you can just change, uh, use a sh link shortener, obviously, because you don't want to sh put your affiliate link directly here. But the thing with uh, the partner program, Aversity partner program is that uh, the customer is going to be locked to you, meaning that if someone buys this, you're going to make a, it's a $9 product, so you're going to make like $4.50. But then uh, if they go and buy more products, like a $1,000 course, you're gonna make $500, so it's gonna be locked to you. So that's one of the benefits of the Aversity Affiliate Program. So yeah, anyway, back to the ad. Um, what we're gonna do is, again, we're just gonna run the ad, send people directly to this, and we're gonna pre-qualify it by telling them how much it costs. That's the really important part, because you know you don't wanna pay for, uh, you don't wanna pay, you don't wanna pay uh, for someone who's not gonna purchase a product, right? Uh, so yeah, and one thing I forgot is that, uh, as a versity, as, as a versity affiliate, you can actually download this in um, in the partner section. Okay, in this resources section, you can download this video and upload it to your to your own YouTube channel to, for advertising. So anyway, let's go here. This is uh, one of my um, staging accounts. Okay, my new staging account, basically. So I'm just gonna create a new campaign. I'm gonna call this. I have some names for him here. I usually name him. Uh, accordingly so you want to create a campaign without any goals uh, video and custom video campaign that's that's the one now what we're gonna do is we're gonna focus on discovery ads all right so let's name this and uh, if you take a look uh, this is the name this is the sales video discovery and PC now I, I usually name them like this um, I started naming him like this, kind of, uh, because I just want to know exactly what I'm looking at. Um, then, because this can get complicated when you have like 20 ads running in your account. Okay, so uh, you want to give it a daily budget. I'm gonna start with uh, 
27. The reason I use 27 is that's three times uh, of the money that I'm going to make if a sale is made. All right, so nine times three, 27. So that's the idea here. Um, so yeah, so that's that. Delivery method, that's, we'll leave it to that. Networks, I'm going to uh, leave search and ads. Partners, no. Leave search and videos, but partners, no. Language, English, location. We're gonna go with the US and um, yeah, we'll stick to US for now. Um, so inventory type, we'll leave it to that. So you could actually try an expanded inventory as well. But yeah, we'll just leave that for now. Um, exclude if you want to. Um, I don't care about that, to be honest. Uh, versus not matter. The only thing is that I'm gonna exclude uh, from embedded videos and live streaming uh, videos, okay? Because live streaming is something people are usually paying attention to. They don't really look at your ad. Uh, so yeah, you don't want to even bother advertising your content in there anyway. Uh, video custom. So let's give it a name. I'm just going to call this V1. Doesn't matter. Demographic. This is where we're going to start doing our targeting. All right. So I'm just going to go with um, age-wise. I'm not going to... Um, yeah. Age... We'll try it, you know, because the thing is, you want to try all this stuff. Um, household income. Uh, remove the top, top 10. That's what I usually do. Uh, mainly because it's not the type, uh, the product you're selling is just really not going to be appealing to this audience. That's the idea here. You know, if someone's making um, top 10, meaning that they're, they're making over a million, I believe, a year. And... Um, this video is not going to be really appealing to them um, so yeah so that's the idea here so you could do uh, audiences I usually just don't do that you know you could play with this I don't usually touch that uh, what I usually focus on is topic and keyword so keyword um, let's do make money online let's see what we get you know the thing is um, you want to have a couple of keywords but you really want to um, look into this you know as you run your ads you want to uh, see how these keywords are doing and all that stuff how to yeah so you want to have a couple extra income Some affiliate marketing as well. Affiliate marketing. Now, I usually, when I do ads, I'm spending more time on the keywords, definitely. Um, now, this would be a really great keyword. I'm going to um, target this separately in a different ad uh, campaign or different ad group right now. Um, but yeah. All right, so that's enough for now. Uh, topics. Um, let's see. See if we can do some marketing related topics. Um, let's keep that. Affiliate programs, let's keep that. All right, that works. The basics, you know. Uh, placements you can actually play with that I usually um, don't unless I'm this it's, it's gonna be a very specific ad you know you could actually go to YouTube and search for videos related to the topic like if you want to let's say you want to search and make money online let me actually show you what I mean by that so um, let's say I go here and I just search for make money online all right If this thing loads, I can make money online. And 
what we do is you search it there's some interesting videos so what you do is you just want to copy these videos and uh, place them uh, basically here so yeah so you just drop the URLs here and you do that again it's something if you want to do you could try it uh, I recommend a separate campaign okay so I'm going to take some notes here because I want to do two separate campaigns okay uh, one separate campaign for fleet marketing course one for place main targeting there you go so that would be two different ad groups that I'm gonna do all right so yeah anyway so next step is the bidding um, I'm going to do 50 or 80 cents it's fine used to be a lot cheaper but um, it's changing it's fine because you usually don't pay that much anyway um, so let's drop the video you drop the URL and uh, video discovery so that would be that and you want to start dropping the um, headline all right so that's it so just create and good to go that's it guys again uh, what you want to do if you want to do this really right uh, you want to make sure you have different variations so that's what I usually do you know I just could basically uh, copy this thing and create a different variation uh, so yeah so that's just something you can do on your own time all right guys thank you so much for watching this video I hope you got some value from it just a couple of things first of all after I finished the recording uh, we I, I made a bunch of changes so you know we added more different copies that's something I do I add multiple ad copies you know multiple headlines and stuff so that's something you should definitely do different targeting keywords and stuff like that and also different um, uh, audiences you know there's a lot of audiences there's a lot of uh, topics that you can target on YouTube so uh, make sure you test out everything and then after a while just uh, kind of uh, remove the stuff that are not working all right so just make sure you do that um, there's a law because the thing is with advertising you just have to run it and you do it for a while until you just improve it and optimize it obviously it's not gonna work out and be a winner uh, on the first day basically all right so just keep that in mind so let me know if you have any questions if not I'll see you next video guys subscribe if you're not a subscriber and if you want to learn more you should definitely click out click the link in the description that's gonna take you to another page where you can learn more about this stuff if you want to just take everything to the next level all right so I'll see you in the next one guys